All right, with new assistant coach Kenyon Spears. Coach, how's uh, New Orleans life treating you so far? So far, so good. You know, I've, I've grew up about five hours away from here in Beaumont, Texas. I actually have some, some close family that live here in the area. Uh, I've been very, very fortunate and proud to be a part of the staff and to be a part of this program so far and, and just trying to take every day and relish the opportunity. All right, we're a few weeks into practice. How are, how are things going? How's the, the team developing thus far? The team is working hard. They come in every day with a ship on their shoulder. You know, they bring a lot of energy and enthusiasm uh, in, in every drill. We're excited about the energy and effort that they produce so far. Every day we got to try to get better with each opportunity and each drill that we do. And we couldn't be more happy for with the things that we've been accomplished so far. Now you're involved in recruiting. What are some of the things that you uh, sell about this university and the city to potential student athletes? Well, I think the big thing is that, you know, there's a lot of diversity here on campus. There's a lot of diversity here in the city. Uh, you know, we're a big research institution that does a lot of things, not only just here on campus, but uh, state and nationwide. And also, uh, you know, our HRT program, the business program, there's a lot of things that kind of sell themselves, but you know, the biggest thing is that the teachers teach a class here. They grade the papers. They're involved in every aspect of the students' uh, participation in the class, and that's a big step to help the students progress in what they're trying to accomplish. All right, everyone we talk to, we ask about November 9th. I mean, we're, we're, we're less than, I guess, two, two, two weeks away. What, what are we thinking about November 9th? Well, I think it's a big, big step for us, you know, going back to Division One. And we've been talking up November 9th, not only on campus, but in the community itself through the businesses, and corporations, and, and other uh, institutions that are involved in uh, year no basketball. We're doing a lot of outreach to, to different uh, groups, civic groups, uh, kids groups, and we're just trying to get everybody involved and be, be part of our family. Uh, and November 9th is the first step to hopefully growing this thing into a big success. All right, thanks, Coach. Thank you.